Hello, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you, the good and wonderful people of the Tube. Hope you're well today, hope you're feeling grand and all is well in your world. Today I have a pedal demo for you, and it's this. The Green Carrot Pedal Corn Star, which is one of the best distortion pedals I have ever played through in my life. This teamed up with a CL120, like it was like they were made for each other, and you will see why in a minute when I get to playing through it. It's amazing, and I can't thank Green Carrot Company enough for sending this pedal. It's so, so good, and I can't wait to show you all its ins and outs and features today. It's amazing. So, uh, without further ado, I'm going to use my 60s strap, my white one, and my, uh, well, 60s reissue, and um, my vintage lemon drop for some of this. Uh, I might get my Eddie Van Halen strap out later on, maybe, I don't know, I haven't decided yet. But um, I'm going to show you, like, you know, the gain, I'm going to show you the tone. I'm going to leave the volume at, uh, at 9 o'clock where it is now for the whole video and it's a very loud pedal and uh, that seems kind of like a real nice volume level um, for this pedal is like there. That's my phone going off, please ignore that. So yeah, without further ado, let me show you this pedal because it is amazing and it goes again. That's probably one of you lovely people. Thank you for that comment, whoever you are, thank you and let's get playing. Just very quickly before I start though, I forgot, I wanted to show you the features. It's very simple, which I love about this pedal. I don't like complex pedals, which is why this is great. Got a gain, tone, volume, and basically this switch here. Up, kind of, it's kind of dark, down is a bit, a little bit brighter. And that's it. So let's get hearing the Corn Star by Green Carrot Pedals. Amazing. Engage. Okie dokie, so bypass signal through the CR120, uh, going through the clean channel, uh, treble is at uh, off basically, uh, bass is at 2 and volume is at 10. New cab everybody, B cab, JSM 900, love it to pieces, here we go, bypass signal. <laughs> Engaging the corn star and the gain is all the way on its lowest setting. Uh, I've got the tone at 12 o'clock and I've got the volume at 9 o'clock and I've got the little switch up. Sounds like this classic rock tone. <laughs> Sounds amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna leave the tone where it is at this point, out at 12 o'clock, and show you the gain dial. And the gain dial is awesome because it's so gradual. Um, some distortion pedals I find it's just like you know it's it just goes like crazy straight away. I love how gradual this is. So check this out. So gain is on its lowest setting. If I put it up to a quarter, so this is uh, lowest setting. Quarter. Little a little bit more gain. Only a little bit, only a smidgen. Halfway. A little bit more. You can hear it's just like you know, it's just getting a little bit more. This is where it starts to kick in now on three quarters. So now we've got three quarters and this is where it starts to get more rocky. good it's making the light flicker but you can hear it getting more and then when you get all the way up to 10 you get mega gain Ow. Try to 
Channeling Bay Malm scene didn't really work. <laughs> this pedal. Let me show you the tone dial now. <gasps> Back in tune. Okay, so tone dial. Let me turn... Uh, I'll leave the gain on full whack. Why not? Uh, this is the tone all the way off now, so basically on its lowest setting. <laughs> Some tone dials are like, for me, are too dark, um, sorry, too bright, sorry, from the get go. So I always have to run tone dials like off. This one I have to run it a quarter, uh, about halfway to get that kind of sound that I, that's in my head. So and that's the first time that's ever happened, ever, ever happened. I can't think of another pedal where I've had to not run the tone off, basically, on its lowest setting to get that sound. So this is, you know, awesome. Anyway, I'm losing my words, so let's just start playing. So, tone at a quarter now, a little bit brighter. Seems to be my happy place. It really does. 
Okay, let me show you the, um, the vintage switch now. Okay, okay, so switched over to the uh, vintage lemon drop now. This is the bypass sound, same thing. Uh, clean channel, same on 20, no treble, bass at 2, volume at 10. <laughs> Awesomeness that is the corn star. Gain, uh, tone is at 12 o'clock, uh, gain is on its lowest setting now, and I've got the vintage switch up. So, this is the uh, kind of lowest gain setting. <laughs> So smooth. Okay, gain now at a quarter. Whoop. Yep, there we go. That's a quarter. So again, really gradual, kind of in increasing gain. <laughs> this to it whatsoever. Uh, gain on three quarters now. Gain all the way up with tone at a half. Okay, 
Okay, and tone all the way up on 10. vintage switch now with the uh, Les Paul. Uh, okay, so I've got the gain at half, I've got the tone on its lowest setting, and I've got the uh, switch down now, which is that kind of bit more brighter kind of vintage uh, setting. <laughs> So you know, it's pretty, it's pretty dark, and we're on up the tone to a quarter now. I'm probably playing like really fast today because I'm overly excited. Too too much stimula stimulation from this pedal. That sounded wrong. Forget what I just said. That's disgusting, day, Bad. At one point over there, I'm here. Anyway, moving along. Tone now at a half with the uh, vintage switch down. Three quarters, this thing is just ridiculously good. Bit too much gain for that, but you get the idea. And then tone all the way up is your desk.
is just destroying my face and everything. Okay, so I'm going to switch back to the Strat and I'm going to show you it through the uh, overdrive or the dirty channel on the CL120 to show you how it kind of like, you know, uh, acts as a kind of a boost, so to say. So let me just show you that quick because there isn't anything this pedal doesn't do as far as I'm concerned. It's just a. Ah! Oh, the words escape me. They really do. Anyway, let me show you that quick. Okay, so I flipped over to CL120's dirty channel now. I've got the volume at 10, trebles off, middles off, bass is at 1, gain is at 5, and it gives me this kind of sound. Turn up a smidgen. So this is kind of like a nice broken up, you know, sound, and then if you add the corn star on top, uh, Volume is at usual place at 9 o'clock, uh, gain and tone are both, both at 12 o'clock, and I've got the vintage switch up. It sounds like this boosts it a little bit more, so... That is glorious. So this is without. This is with. to 12 o'clock now, so again, uh, tone back at 12, vintage switch down, so again, this is the bypass, this is the uh, CL20 alone, oh no, sorry, that's with it engaged, this is valid, this is weird.
Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video on the Green Carrot Pedals Corn Star. I said that I'm actually shaking, like a little bit, sh a little bit shaky, like too much adrenaline is coursing through my body at this point in time because of this pedal. It just, it's just inspiring sound. It just, <sighs> I don't have the words to describe how good this is. Everybody needs one of these. It, ah. Oh, it's such a great distortion pedal. It really is. It does, well, distortion overdrive, whatever you want to call it. It's just mega. It works on top of a dirty sound. It works on top of a clean sound. It... <sighs> My brain is just gone. Green carrot pedals, look what you've done to me. You've destroyed me. <sighs> this is mega. Absolutely mega. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope my weirdness hasn't got too stupid in this video. I got carried away a lot. It just has the sound that's in my head. That's that, that's what it is. It, the, the sound that's in my head comes out of this pedal when I plug it into the Sound 20s clean channel or dirty channel. It's just something about it. Oh, absolutely mega. So, hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again very, very soon for another one. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Green Carrot Pedals. Go and check them out. I'll put the... Um, website in the link in the description box below oh i love this thing i bet you can't tell from the uh, the amount of bad press i obviously get it anyway love it to bits corn star by green carrot pedals thank you so much for watching i'll see you again very 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 soon for another video goodbye now